biological science technician and I work for the Department of Agriculture and a subsection of that which is called the Agricultural Research Service. Um, specifically, I work at a bee biology lab. So at our lab, we study all aspects of bee biology. Um, my actual job is I work in a lab where we study the diseases that the bees get. So I have sort of a combination of things that I do. Half the time I spend in the lab and when I'm in the lab I extract DNA from bees and I run it through processes that tell me if the bee is sick. Um, and then the other half the time, usually in the summer, I get to go out to the fields, I get to go to the plants where the bees are flying uh, and collect data. I collect things such as pollen, I collect bees. Bees are really important to work with and important to study because every third bite of food that you take comes from a bee. And you might not think, you might think of things like a fruit comes from a bee because there's a flower that a bee pollinates, but even a hamburger comes from a bee. One of the things we study are, is alfalfa, alfalfa bees. Uh, and alfalfa is what you feed to cows. So you need alfalfa in order to have that food. Most people, when they think of bees, they think of honeybees. And honeybees are a very important species for pollinating plants in our ecosystem. However, at this lab, we study native bees. And native bees, in this Intermountain West region, there's 3,500 different types of these native bees, which play an important role in pollination as well. I've always been interested in the out of doors, into the insects that I see every day, uh, into plants and trees. So when I went to college, I majored in biology. When I'm not doing my job as a lab technician, I like to do a lot of other things. I like to run marathons, I like to climb rocks, but I love to play ice hockey. <laughs>